Hello everyone, um, just wanted to cover this real quick. It's a Silhouette Studio Basic, I think. I just downloaded it real quick. Um, so essentially, what we're gonna try and do is put in a font so that we can cut it out but have it attached to the surroundings. So um, I'll just show you real quick how I would do it. Um, Again, you're going to have your shape, like your overall large shape. And I'm thinking there's probably a better way of doing all this, but again, just not being familiar with this a lot. Okay, so we have our shape. And then let's say we're wanting to add a spot down here. Um, that just to, so we can see it um, okay we'll get that centered what we're gonna do is we're gonna select both of those and we're gonna come over here to the side to our modify panel and what we want to do is we want to cut that shape out of the overall bigger shape so what we want to do is have both selected and then we want to hit subtract and so what that does is now that is a missing piece rather than just a white piece over the top of it. So now we can take and we can get a font and get our name. Um, and this is a little different than what I'm used to as for me a font is always a stroke or a line and then I actually have to outline it but it seems like in here it just auto becomes a fill by just changing the thing again we want these to be connected so we need to come over to our text section and we'll select say this font and again, this isn't going to be perfect. You'll have to make it look pretty. But I'm going to drag them over the edge a little bit so that they're overlapping that side. So there's something for them to attach to. And then simply just highlight both of them, grab all of them, and come over to your modify again and hit weld. And so now, you can see it's all one piece. So if we zoom in. Oh, way too far. Sorry about that. You can see how there's the, the points or the anchors that show that it's actually connected to that. So then if we took this, oh, well, We could, if we wanted to cut it, sorry, not way familiar with this program. So then you can see your cut lines. And I do cut lines in red. So there you go. Now you can see that it's just one solid shape and that will cut out nicely for you. So anyway, I hope that helps. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.